looking for someone who stole from a center for children with autism. Well, the manager isn't confident they'll find who is responsible, but she wants them to know what they really took. What used to be stacked on this wooden platform was expected to inspire smiles, laughs, and good memories for children with autism. We wanted to give them more room to run and play. $400 worth of mulch was stolen from Little Star ABA Therapy in Lafayette. It was going to be used to expand the playground here. That was supposed to take place this coming weekend. But now the project has been delayed. It just made me kind of sick to my stomach. I, I just, I realize whoever probably took it doesn't realize what type of center we are. All right, hey, let's build it, come on. Or at least she hopes not. Manager Shelly Will ordered new mulch, but she says $400 is a lot for this nonprofit. Any extra that we spend in, in in my opinion, it's taking away from the kids because we try to be as frugal as possible so that more money can go into their programs. She feels like police probably won't be able to catch the person or people responsible. Since we did not have security cameras in the back and since there is quite a bit of problem with people driving around and taking things from local parking lots like this, there really wasn't a whole lot that they could do because they couldn't prove that the person stole the mulch and they may not even be from this area. But in the case the thief is watching, Will has a message. You, you do not realize what you've done. Um, it, it, it isn't just a, a small crime to us. It, it took away a playground, not permanently, but for a while for these children. If you'd like to donate to Little Star ABA Therapy, a link can be found on our website, WLFI.com. Well, beginning tomorrow, hundreds of people are expected to cheer.